Good kitten internet. We're gonna pick up where we left off. And we're gonna go to Kadingel. If I can remember how in the world to actually get there. I... I mean, once I can actually arrive, I'll remember, but... I'll recognize it pretty easily from the air. Problem is that I don't remember exactly where it's at. I think it's down in the Southern Islands area. I did get this one already, right? That's right, I can't land here because there's an actual thing here. I think it's like over this way somewhere. So yeah, these are the three islands of conflict. I want to say like over here somewhere. That's Baskar. You know what? Screw it. I'm going to look it up. Okay. South from Adelaide. Well, Adelaide's right here, so south. There it is. Alright, now we actually need to use the ocarina for the first time in a long time. Range, because we're going a walking. Adingel. I knew if I waited here, you would eventually. Or, I knew if I waited here, you would eventually come. I was just holding that in reserve so it wouldn't be spoiled. Siegfried is after the uh, after the new moon called Malduk. This is the dimensional elevator, Kadingel, which leads to the space colony. I told you, Wild Arms is a sci-fi game. What is it with me and playing sci-fi genre games? Um, Wild Arms one, two, three, XF. All of them are definitely sci-fi games. Just that the sci-fi trappings are a little more hidden than even Wild uh, even Might and Magic. Why are you telling us this? What do you want? Malduk is a colony that existed a thousand years ago that has the ability to attack Vilgaia. It's easy to guess what Siegfried wants to do with it once he acquires it. Now that you know, I'm sure you plan on heading to Malduk. But there will be many people who get in your way, including me. You can't go ahead unless you defeat me. Bring it. Only battle will quench my thirsty heart. I thirst for the fight. Hello, Boomerang. You're probably not anywhere near as scary as you used to be. Let's be honest here. Heck, Jack is faster than you now. And I do way more damage than I used to. Rudy's faster than you. Cecilia is faster than you. You're slow. Double boomerang dynamic. 655. Black Fang. 150. Yeah, boomerang's not as strong as it used to be. Nova. Actually, does Magnum Fang do more damage than Nova? Like, as in total damage. Uh, let's see. Let's see. Phaser Lucid. More high shield? Sure. Why not? It does about the same. Might as well keep just with this. Black Fang! Don't care. Though they're approximately Cecilia's speed. More defense. Double boomerang dynamic on Cecilia! Oh no, you dealt 876. 
I've been fighting normal enemies that do more damage than this. Just saying. Uh, actually, I'm gonna go back to Cosmic Nova. Um, Azer. Paper Jack. Yeah, it's worth doing well. Or, uh, worth doing that one. And Lucid's down already. I just can't keep up. Zero armor attack! Oh no! That actually dealt damage! Quick! Heal Cecilia. Uh, might as well phase her. Um. Actually, you know what? Nah, just keep attacking. Switch over to Magnum Fang. Phaser some more, and some Guardian, because I can. I'm sorry for the disturbing scene. That dealt nearly 9,000 damage. Zero armor attack on Jack? Oh no! Did less damage on Jack, but it's a zero armor attack. I, I don't get it. Maybe Cecilia just rolled really bad? Or they rolled really high on Cecilia, whatever. Anyway, more Fang, more Phaser. You know what? Randomizer. One downside to Boomerang is that he doesn't move, so I can't tell when he's ending. This is... <laughs> I have no regrets. Perk. Funk. Decent amount of XP, but no money. I have witnessed the potential. Alright, I have witnessed that that the potential of human beings is endless. Go. Go through and defeat Siegfried. I like this. Power used to protect something precious. Something all... Uh, what? You have overstepped your bounds one too many times. Boom! We are finished with you. You will die with the humans. Right here, right now. Go, humans. I'll take it from here. Right? There's a transport device on the top of Kadigal. I'm letting you guys go. I'm not saving you. Remember, I'm the one who hunts the perfect prey. Until that day, my friends, go now, hurry. Rudy's the one that stays behind, because Rudy and Boomerang are very similar to each other. They're both demons. Uh, they're both demons that have fought alongside of humans. Well, Rudy's a metal de a Anyway, yeah. Never lose my... F just, I'll never stop unless if I lose my desire to fight. Come, Lucid, guardian of desire. Oomph. Lucid. I'm gonna take a little trip to hell. Together. I shall return to hunt the perfect prey. The humans turn hope into power, then I can turn desire into a blade. Let's go. Welcome to Kadigal. Oh man, that was a rough combat. So let's leave. Saber Fang acquired. I don't think the Saber Fang's actually usable. I'll be back. Good thing, too, because we're going to make him come back. Okay. Let's go to Milma. Fly and heal. Too far. Go to our favorite place in the world, the Isolated Guild by Milma, because it's the only one I remember where it's at beyond the um, one by the Ancient Arena. Of course I will try your potion. 
Oh yeah, I have more secret signs. I'll keep one secret sign around. Oh, that's right. Um, all flowers. I honestly don't know if we're powerful enough to take this on. We're going to go to a um, secret boss, and it's not supposed to be, but this is the hardest boss in the game. By a significant margin. Also, has their own totally awesome battle music. <sighs> Reload ammo. Save. Oh boy, do we need to save. Save failed? Wait, what? That was weird. I, I don't know what happened. Okay, well, I made a save state just in case. So, let's go into the arena, shall we? This is my prey! Go home and play with your toys. So, you've been waiting for me, human warriors. To settle my score with you, I came dancing all the way up from the fires of hell. I've attained new powers. My obsessive desire to fight bonded with the Guardian of Desire to create the ultimate power. The Guardian Blade Devil Blade Lucid. Uh, yeah, I'm wondering if this is a translation thing, because Guardian Blade in Wild Arms is a nuke. That's not a nuke, that's a weapon. Feel the power of the blade, which has been forgotten to the far corners of legend. So, Boomerang Flash is the hardest enemy in the game in my mind. And counts as a boss, so I can't use Divide Shot or anything like that. I probably should have upgraded Wild Bunch some, but that's fine. And we are going to need to high shield the crap out of things, assuming I survived the first round. Got a boomerang maximum. Perk. See what I mean now? Hardest boss in the game. Also, Rang Flash is the fastest boss in the game, if I remember right. So I'm going to actually reload from save state, because I'm going to die. There's no way for me to actually fight that that way. So... Yeah. One goat doll should be fine. We've already gone through this. Okay, let's try that again, shall we? Okay. What do I have? Ouch is worthless. We don't need money anymore. Um. I'm going to equip on you. Reflex, I guess. I re is that seriously Rudy's best shield? And you don't need full Libra. I'm gonna equip Boom Getter. Boom Getter? Just immediately heal Blade Cecilia. Uh, Phaser, Cecilia, Aura. Oh. Yep, Goat Doll took the blow. Heal Blading Cecilia immediately. Phaser. Aura to get everybody back up, although it's not gonna get people up by enough. Only Cecilia's standing. This might not work. First off, let's replace Cecilia's goat doll. Do 
Crystal Blade yourself. Phaser, Cecilia, Aura. Your account execution. Ah, uh, Rudy's very dead. No, he survived. I'm surprised. Okay, Jack is back up high enough now. Which means Jack can now accelerate or heal Rudy. Blade, Rudy. Which won't actually be enough to max out his hit points, but he should be able to survive at least. Um, Rudy, Phaser, Cecilia, we need that stupid high shield up. Zero count execution on Jack. Dead. It's an instant death attack. Cool. Rudy, if you get a chance to go, go ahead and full heat revive Jack. Cecilia, just Aura, I guess. Or do I want another high shield? I want another high shield. Got a boomerang maximum, that's gonna make Cecilia go herk. Yep. That's fine, go doll took the blow. Full reviving Jack. Okay, so Jack should be able to take a hit. Cecilia and Rudy definitely can't. So the only way I can actually win reliably in this combat is to basically abuse goat dolls. There's no other way for me to pull this off. Because... I mean, Shadow Boomerang Maximum does over three grand of damage, and it happens immediately. Um, my partner, when they went through this combat the first time, never saw a Shadow Boomerang Maximum the entire time, and was wondering why I was saying this was an extremely difficult fight. Um, but they something happened where they had to reload, went through this fight again, and immediately lost. Just turn one complete wipeout, I believe it was. Um, when they eventually watched this video, they'd be able to correct me. Okay, um, heal blade Rudy. Rudy, I want you to protect her. Cecilia, Aura. Yep, that's what I was expecting to have happen. Rudy actually survived because he was defending. Nice. That worked out way better than I was expecting. Okay, Cecilia is the only one that is in danger to speak of. And uh, no, that's not too. Jack's in danger. So, first off, more goat dolls. Just to have everybody with goat dolls at this point. Actually, Rudy doesn't need a goat doll this turn. Rudy, go ahead and equip Reflex. I need to actually do damage. Shields. Zero count execution. Who's getting instant death? Rudy is. Herc. Damn it. Holy crap, the goat doll didn't work. I didn't realize instant death worked through a goat doll. Well, crap. Uh, I might be a little screwed right now. Actually, I want you to heal Blade after. Revive Rudy. Evil Sword Lucid! He doesn't actually do that much damage. That's his weakest attack. But that's fine. He can heal Blade himself and be back up to full. Rudy's back up to full. Cecilia's the only one that's not. That's fine. In theory, I can accelerate Heal Blade Cecilia, and Cecilia should be able to take the hit now. Cecilia's had a few rounds of um, high shield, I think. Phaser. Um, Cecilia, why don't you Mystic a Mega Berry? Because somebody's gonna need the healing. If not all of us. 
Uh, it's a Shadow Boomerang. Cecilia might be dead from that. No! Good, the high shields actually worked. Mystic! It's been a while since we've used Mystic. Okay, and everybody's at max. And that's not true, but everybody's at high enough where they're not gonna die. Okay, which means that I can actually attack this turn. Bang. Phaser. Do I want to main I want to maintain healing, to be honest. Your account execution. Damn it. And it's on Jack. Goat Doll took the blow this time. I didn't Goat Doll take the blow for Rudy last time. Did I forget to re-equip Rudy with a Goat Doll or something? Oh, that's right. Rudy... No, I had switched Rudy. I'm the goat doll. I don't know. I'm losing track of things. Heal blade yourself if you can. If not, nothing I can do about it other than goat doll. Um, Rudy, let's go ahead and... Actually, I want you to phase her. Cecilia. Maximum. Jack won't survive that. That's fine. We're blading himself. Soul guard, so now Cecilia should be immune to instant death. Uh, no matter who gets hit, they will die. Unless it's Jack with, like, a weak attack. Oh, yeah. Speaking of Jack. Let's re-equip Goat Doll. This is why we have them. Heal Blade yourself. No. Heal Blade Cecilia. Rudy. Just Phaser. Not worth doing anything else. Um, Cecilia. You know what? Actually, I take back what I said. Rudy, Ambrosia. Which at that point, Jack doesn't need to heal blade because it's not going to do anything. Magnum Fang. Ambrosia. Well, everybody will be fully healed. Throw up another high shield. I think there's room for one more. All three of them have just gotten good healed. Rudy should have had a goat doll equipped. Did I forget to equip it again? I... Yes, I did. Dang it, me. I am eating through these goat dolls. Okay. I'm dead. Let's just admit that I'm dead. And this is going to be a rebuild round. Yep, both dead. We both have goat dolls equipped, so that should be fine. Full reviving Rudy, Ambrosia to get everybody else up, and we should be okay. For a round. Not forget to re-equip goat dolls this time. Dang it, me. Um, Cecilia should still be immune to instant death. Once everybody's immune to instant death, I should be able to handle this battle a little bit better, but I don't know if there's gonna be enough battle left to care. Um, phaser. Don't heal enough with aura. You know what? Just use more Ambrosia. I've got plenty and I can repeat them. Your account execution, so that's a goat doll. Or not. Hmm. 
That was a waste of an Ambrosia. Oh well. Maybe it'll. Uh, maybe Rain Flash will actually get taken out this round. No. No, he will not be. I really like that design for Rain Flash. I used that as my avatar for so long online. Uh, let's go with more Magnum Fang. Go with more Phaser. Go with. Aura, I guess. Your account. Oh, I forgot. Oh, that's right. It didn't actually get used. Rudy, who's still up. Wing Flash must be getting low on hit points. It doesn't have that many. It's just that it's a very difficult fight. That's all. If I accelerate Heal Blade Rudy, I'm still fine for a round. Um... Wild Bunch, because you're just gonna get killed at some point anyway. And... Hmm, let's stop some more instant death, I guess. Soul Guard... Jack. Let's get the healers up. Mm -hmm. Got a boomerang. Everybody's at maximum hit points. Sure, it should be okay this turn. Or not. 13 hit points. 13. Please just die. That'd be really convenient right now. No? Cool. English Shadow Boomerang was going to knock out all three of my characters. Good thing all three have goat dolls. Okay. Um. Be an extra 2,045 hit points. There's a chance Rudy wouldn't use a goat doll if I healed, but that's about it. You know what? Ambrosia. Rudy, lock on, wild bunch. Cilia. Already getting Ambrosia, so there's no reason to do Guardian. I want you. The Hyper Rudy. Rudy's doing more damage than everybody else right now. That happened before. That was a really bad set of timing, but that's okay. And you're immune to instant death. Sweet. That actually worked out well. Wild Bunch. I can maintain this if Jack can maintain being first. Accelerator will guarantee that, and I can heal Blade Cecilia. Uh, that might not be enough to keep her up, but that should work. Phaser. Cecilia is going to High Guardian. Sword Lucid. Sweet! That makes things easier. Phaser. That's doing more damage, just not that much more. Let's ref Tina up. But he's at full health. Now we time to Fang. Time to lock on Wild Bunch. Time to Hyper Jack, I guess. Zero count to X. And Cecilia, that's fine. Bunches of wilds. It's a really long fight. Probably the longest fight we've had in a long time outside of the um, aliens. That was even longer. Accelerator. Heal Blade Cecilia. Hold on. Cecilia will gain that 17. or. yeah, about 1700 hit points. A little under. Uh, that's not actually enough. So it's not worth doing that. It's worth doing a regular Heal Blade for. Phaser. 
Cecilia, how about... No. Let's start doing damage. Yep, that was a mistake. Oh well. Cecilia's down. And back up. Oh, I can accelerate her inversion next turn, so that shouldn't be that bad. How much does Sand actually do? Yeah. Accelerator. Oh, that's right, yeah. Sure. It's like, wait, it's only hitting one? Yeah, it's because I'm not mistaking it. Um... You're just phasering. So yeah. Just or after. Should keep people's hit points up to a reasonable amount, I think. Well, that's a full heal. Ah crap. Another shadow boot brain. And I forgot to equip the Godol on Cecilia. Dang it. to seven more goat dolls. This is getting risky. Okay. Um, or revive Cecilia. Ambrosia. Get everybody back up. Because, yep, that's a full wipe. But luckily, goat dolls. Full heal. Yeah, I think when they're getting wiped like that, they lose their high shield, which is the reason why I'm taking so much more damage now. Since it used to take 2,000 something damage. Okay, um. We still haven't seen what Fang looks like after being hybrid. Nope, 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 nope. Let's remember doing things the right way. We're really low on goat dolls now, but this will work. Fang. Phaser. High shield. No. Mm, yeah, high shield. I boom my maximum. That'll knock out Cecilia and bring everybody down to garbage. Oh no, Cecilia lived. Sweet. And down. Sweet. <laughs> Miracles. The human's belief system that makes the impossible possible. The power that protects Vilgaia. Looks like this is the end. Did I lose? No. No, I did not. I lived the life of a demon warrior. I fought and lost my life. I was not defeated. I lived a life of my own dreams, for I have lived. I have no regrets. I'm a winner. My death is glorious. Look. 20,000 XP. Divine Blade acquired. That is the best weapon in the game for Rudy. And that was instead of a combat, uh, instead of an arena battle. Everybody has really hurt. But. That is the end of the tale of Boomerang. And oh boy, am I saving. And then, then I'm going to save state because that really scared me when it decided to not actually save. Save state, okay. Got that done, halfway through the video. We could continue through Ka Dingel, or we can do some more random um, stuff. So, first thing is first, before I do anything else, we're going to heal. I guess in. How do you smell a perfume?
That's not flat. That's oops, there we go. There we go. Isolated guild. And let's heal. Are you going to finally do the red potion? No. Okay, and more flowers needed for nobody. Okay. Next up, where in the world do I need to take the sweet candy? No, kitten. Okay. Ah. Cat. Okay. Do, 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 do. Deep, dark patch of water southeast of Adelaide. Okay. Just need to know where it was supposed to be, and it's Adelaide. Oh, right, I actually have to teleport there. Apparently, Isu really just wanted to be in the camera instead of Maya. I'll move Maya out of the way. Okay, southeast of Adelaide, deep patch of. Go over here. Lower left corner of the square to the right of the square that it lights in, so south. But yeah, this area. I'm just going to speed this up until I actually get the correct encounter. spot. Come on. There we go. Something is rising from the depths. Remember that last time we saw something like that happen? That's right, we're fighting another golem. This golem is Leviathan. Hello, Leviathan. This is actually one of the easier battles in my mind. Fang. Phase. My shield? We don't need the cooked dolls anymore. Let's actually equip useful things. Yeah, 
That's about the same. Ooh, Leviathan, slow. Trident! Well, that's definitely a physical attack. Who likes Trident? I do, I do. Bang. Is... It's hyper up Jack, I'd say. So they're doing roughly equivalent amount of damage. Jack technically has higher attack. Phaser just doesn't get affected by defense. So I'd rather hyper up Jack. That should do more damage. Deep Sea Cyclone! Mmm, that's magic. That wasn't actually that much damage. I could take another hit without much of an issue. So I'll just aura. Phaser. And aura. Magnum Fang. Yeah, that does a lot more damage. It's basically double damage. This thing probably doesn't have anything in the way of defense, does it? Deep Sea Cyclone, after I just healed up from the last one. Okay, that's fine. Bang. Fury Shot Wild Punch. And... Aura. Keep up hit points is fine. Should do 9999, I'm guessing. Okay. Yes. Still has hit points, though. Reactor Torpedo! Ow. You can take another hit, that's not a big deal. Regular heal, I guess. So this one's one of the easier golems. So I've been able to get it for a while. Ooh, went past this time. That's fine. And dead. I don't know what is with that little <laughs> freak out thing. 10,000 XP, 8,000 Gala, and a pretty dress. It is Cecilia's best equipment. And it's best by a large margin. It makes her magic resistance awesome. And I will check all of these things for Mystic when I have a chance. So, uh, let's teleport back to... Oh, no, I can't teleport yet. We actually have to land to teleport, so I might as well just sail back to where I need to go. Okay, let me think. What else am I missing for random... Or not random, but powerful, optional bosses that I can actually reach right now. Well, first off, I need to buy more goat dolls, because oh boy did I obliterate all my goat dolls. Yeah, I have eight. Let's at least get back up to 25. That'll work. And we can unequip force unit and equip reflex again. Really, reflex is my best shield. <sighs> I'm wondering if one of the optional bosses has a better shield for Ruby. Okay. So I've defeated Angomoa, I've defeated Barbados, I've defeated Rain Clash, I've defeated Leviathan. Can't do that until Saint Centaur. So I might need to quickly go do Saint Centaur. Uh, yeah. I have Saint Centaur. And that's it for optional bosses I can touch right now. So. Let's save first. Before I do anything else.
And also reload ammo. Got to do that. I'm gonna do that first. Yes. Now you can say. There we go. Gotta love how the emulator speed up button also makes it where saving and loading is faster. Let's just hop on over. We are probably going to have to do Saint Centaur really fast. Which, this is going to be ridiculous. But, let's find out if we actually have to. I'm wondering if I can get away without doing Saint Centaur at all. Which, I'm going to have to go back and do anyway, just so I can get all the Guardians, but... First off. Yeah, there's still loot here. That's right, there's going to be loot here because I can't take everything because people are alive. Yeah, it's Rudy. Huh! Okay, so this is what's supposed to happen when she's talked to, um... Whatchamacallit, um... After, at this point of the game, assuming that you had done Saint Centaur. So they updated her dialogue, but everybody else is still alive. This is really bizarre. Who's this guy I've been seeing lately? A little weird, but he seems sincere enough. That voice. It's Jack. Been a long time, stranger. S someone else visiting me. Very nice to me. Swordsman too. A little odd, but very funny. Feels like... Celia. How are you? This swordsman I've been seeing. Very nice, but a little hyper. I wonder if he'll visit me today. Have you figured out who she's talking about yet? <laughs> Give you a little bit longer to figure it out. A little bit longer. I wonder if this will event will even trigger. It should. By the way, this event I specifically told my partner about. I let my partner go through the entire game without any spoilers or anything like that. I didn't tell them where they should go until I mentioned at the end of the game if they hadn't already or at the end of the game where they think that they have free roam to things to let me know. And then I asked them what they had done for optional content and pointed them this way. There's a really good reason why I did this because this is among my favorite parts of the game. That's right. It's Zed. Look at that handsome man. You persistent bastards! What are you doing here? Why are you here? Are you here to take my little paradise away? Here I go, ready or not! I'll crush your little... Will you fight against Zed? This is not a but thou must, by the way. You can actually say no. Here, let me show you. No. You want to pick a fight with a guy who's in his prime? Do you know how dangerous that is? Well, I'm feeling generous today. Why don't you go? And he leaves. You. This is totally optional. But I'm going to fight him. By the way, that's Zed's actual form. Welcome to Monster Zed. This is heaven! Here I am, the Grim Reaper's pen pal, the ultimate macho man. Oh yeah. This is the only time in the game that... Oh, I forgot to heal. Ooh, that might not be good. Zed is a genuine threat right now. He's genuinely hard to fight. Not, you know, boomerang flash level of hard. Just, you know, not easy. Let's go ahead and heal up. That was my mistake. You got me? I don't actually know how to say that. And Herc. Yep. 
This is going well already. Gaia Crash! That's right, Zed's a spellcaster right now. Zed's a very powerful spellcaster. Is that the very high level of spellcasting? Also, Zed's really fast now. As in Zed whip before Jack. Okay. What's Ambrosia? And cast Awaken. Doombringer! That's right, you see. Doombringer. Wake everybody up and keep them awake. Alright, now that we're actually starting the combat. Oh well. Fang. Phase. I'm going to aura just to keep things up. So yeah, an area of effect attack that deals thousands of damage and thousands of points of damage and also falls make people fall asleep. That's a pretty darn powerful attack. Yeah, really, I think my best bet might actually just be to have Cecilia constantly aura. Actually, no. I can make this work without. I can high shield this turn. Doombringer! Let's get some shield on. We can heal blade Rudy. Uh, Rudy, continue phasering. Cecilia, we're going to have you dual cast. We're gonna have you dual cast high shield and high shield. Ow! That's not good. Go ahead and give nectar to Jack. Cecilia Aura. Doombringer! That should full heal and cure all the status effects. Yeah. This is actually a difficult fight. And it's Zed. Zed's never been a challenge. Also, what is with that face? I think it's just hair. Because his hair is green. And it's just everywhere. Vision. Um, we're gonna save up for a Fury Shot. And... Let's think. That must have hurt. Not as much as that did, though. I'm probably just going to use another Ambrosia. I mean, what's the use of having these items if I don't use them, right? I actively try to make sure I don't do the whole, um, I have an inventory full of items and I'm at the end of the game in an RPG thing. Bunch. Um... Should be nine 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 nine. <coughs> 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 that aura 
was worthless. That's fine. It's time to hang phase and saint. Ooh, that's saint. Hmm. Jack's now faster than Zed from time to time. That's the all status effect attack. Which luckily, I am currently immune to. Status lock expires next turn, I think. Yeah, he's not weak against any given type of magic, it's just that he's a mage right now. Which, what? Uh, Fang. Phase. High Guardian. Appropriate time to High Guardian. Raftina. Raftina should love Zed. Zed's so cool. And Zed's down. Wait a minute! Give me a chance to explain! Ah! Herc. 16,666 experience received. You bring her acquired. Just listen to me, okay? I won't run. There was an accident with the gate generator. I was caught in it and ended up in here in this town. I didn't know what was happening. There were monsters everywhere, except there aren't because we are sequence broken. I saw this woman. I told her I would to, I told her to keep quiet. To keep quiet. Screenshot taken. I'm going to use this as a thumbnail because, oh gods, why? I may blur out Zed out of that one. I don't know. It was calm and quiet. Ugh, quiet. Later, I found out that she was blind. For the first time in my life, I feel complete. She was the first person that treated me normally. It felt kind of nice, so I decided to stay and poked out around the house. I'm afraid you might tell her who I was, that's why I attacked. Yeah, I'm a demon. Kill me. You sure talk a lot for a demon. Mine needs one shot. Hey! You're a lot meaner than you look. No, stop. I really believe Zed doesn't want to die. He's discovered life other than one of fighting. We should let him stay this town. I mean, you can help the blind. What do you think, Rudy? So, I think this is a but thou must, but I actually don't know because I've never said no. Let's find out. Let me go, please. I beg of you. I don't want to be separated from the girl. Yeah, it looks like it's a but thou must. Yeah, it is. Okay. You guys are really nice people, aren't you? I'm a bored again guardian! I'll protect this girl with my life! We shall meet again, friends. Don't forget me. I'm Zed the Deviant. What I really wish had happened as a result of this game is that the next game would have Zed as a guardian. That would be perfect. Or, you know... Zed pretend to be one of the Guardians, or yeah, pull a Gilgamesh, basically. Uh, well, we'll just have to wait and see. So yeah, that is the thing that I wanted to make sure had happened for us. We have covered everything that's not in Codingel, um, other than this town. So what I'm going to do is that the save that I'm about to make right here, this is going to be the save that things are going to split a bit. Um, so there's a little bit that we still want to do in Kadengel, but I'm going to make sure that the main game keeps the, uh, glitch that we have for Saint Centaur. However, I need to complete Saint Centaur for, um, getting the last of the runes, which that is the only rune left, is the one that is, you know... 
there. Um, that's the last guardian. So I'm going to have to complete that. Because of that, uh, and also for the Mystic Guide. Um, yeah, because of that, I'm going to basically split it a little bit. Oh, and to answer a question from, I believe it was Peter. Oh, it's not that one. There's the bone that's being guarded by the dog. Not there. Where was that at? I'm just shocked that the game hasn't, like, kick it out. There it is. So that's the one that I'm trying to get. So hand pan can't reach. And if I get close enough to try to wand, I basically I can't move while the dog's moving. And the dog just biffs me in the face. I go around to the other side. Once more, can't reach with hand pan, and dog biffs me in the face. I can't get the bone without um, letting Saint Centaur die. So I'll worry about that next time. Um, I think my next video is probably going to be a series of Let's Analyze, just so I can get the rest of them out of the way. Uh, the only thing I don't have right now... Let's see. I don't have... Whatever is supposed to be here, because I'm pretty sure it's not supposed to be Reflex. I don't have that. Uh, the Battle Cloak is not the best armor in the game for Rudy, if I remember right. I don't think the Dawn Poncho is the best armor in the game for Jack. Oh, um, I forgot to equip the Divine Blade this entire time. Whoops. So, Doombringer is actually a worse weapon for Jack than Juggernaut, but it's better than all the rest of his weapons. But you notice that other bottom arrow? It drops his luck to the worst possible result, which is hilarious. Uh, what happens if I equip that and say, Amulet? My luck is normal. That's the most that you can do with the Doombringer. But anyway, there's no reason to use the Doombringer because I have a Juggernaut. Okay, we're going to stop it here. Hope you've enjoyed this internet. And like I said, the next set of videos will probably be some more Let's Analyze. Talk to you later. Bye. Maya says bye too. Bye.